Hey, what's going on, guys? It is TES Nuts, and I am here with another episode of Would You Rather, and this time I am joined by the lovely Kaboom and Riz. What is going on, fellows? Hey there, fellow. <laughs> hey. Hey. Hey, guys. What's up? It's Riz. Hey. Hey. Wow. All right. <laughs> so, yeah. <laughs> um, you guys know how this goes. We'll get right into it. Um, Boom, I will let you start it off. So okay. Go right All right, I got a question for you then. Uh, would you rather play with yourself in front of your best friend or have your best friend play with you? Well, that's a simple question because I play with myself in front of my best friends all the time. <laughs> that's fair enough. That's yeah. easy. I mean, that's, that'd be like a normal everyday thing for me. Okay. No, no I'd, rather, I'd rather, I mean, if I had to pick, I'd feel kind of gay with my best friend playing with me. Yeah, it's kind of so, tough, man. Unless it was a female. Hmm. So then that'd be okay. Well, that's a weird twist. Yeah, but uh, I'm assuming we're going with a guy, so for the sake of the game. So, yeah. All right. I'd rather play with myself. All right. All right. Okay. All right, um, Riz. What's up, man? What's up with you? You know, I'm just sitting. <laughs> All right, cool. Would you rather drink horse sperm or chew a cow's dingleberry? <laughs> okay, it might sound stupid, but what, what's a dingleberry? Is that like the point between? Are you serious right now? Like, like, like a turd hanging off the asshole. It's like oh. a little one that doesn't come off. That you like that? Shake yeah. around a little bit. You know, I'd have to go with the dingleberry because you know, I don't know. It seems like it tastes good or better. <laughs> it's a little bit of hot sauce on it, you know. It's great. It seems like it would taste good. Yeah, man, it tastes good. I don't know where the logic is in that, but I'll go with it. All right, my turn. Shut up. Um, all right, this is to nuts. All right, kaboom. Oh, no, it's to me, dude. Kaboom. All right. You stay alive. All right. Okay, kaboom. So, okay. would you rather make uh-huh. sex no- sex noises every time you took a dump, or make cat noises every time you pee? Are we assuming that I don't make sex noises every time I take a dump? Yeah. 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 Because, yeah. because, because I, I can't. To be honest, who doesn't? Like, um. Exactly. So um, I'm just gonna have to go with that one, just because it's it's kind of more natural. Hmm. The mm. dump one. Yeah, the dump one. You don't make sex noises when you take a dump. Yeah. Especially like a orgasm? really big dump Pushing. that. Dude, it actually, you know, like it feels kind of good, dude. When you like when you're you gotta, you gotta go. Sometimes a good, healthy, hearty dump is orgasmic. Yeah, people it people, is, man. If it's nice and solid. Shit. If they say it doesn't. It's like, man, I wish I could do that all over again. Yeah, I agree. <laughs> I agree, 100. percent all right. All right, nuts. Would you rather yes. be handcuffed to a bed naked in the middle of a highway or have pictures of you being handcuffed to a bed naked on the Internet? Both of those have already happened. So, oh. no. Um, pictures of it happening or it happening. Wait. Both, technically, wouldn't they both have to happen if there's pictures of it happening? No, no. The first one, you're actually literally on a bed in the middle of a highway handcuffed naked. Okay, and the second one is what? Second one is pictures of you on a bed, handcuffed naked, on the internet. Um, I'd rather be on the highway because the internet is permanent. You know, like once it's on the internet, it's gonna be on the internet forever. Someone's always gonna have it. Okay. In real life, you know, people drive by, they're like, "Oh, hey, who's that naked guy?" And then they'll just carry on with their day. You know? Yeah. Maybe they'll pull over. Maybe they will. Maybe they'll jump on the bed with me. You never know. (laughs) No, I but I'm going to go with the real-life highway bed scenario, okay. I think. All right. Riz. Okay. What's up? Would you rather drink a liter of your mother's period blood... Come on. ...or get banged by hobos who film it and put it on the Oh, come on, dude. What kind of question is this, man? Dude. Uh, I had to... Uh, I had to go... Yeah, you got to answer for the sake of the game. By the hobos, guys. Of course they are. Ah, uh, why? They don't have they don't girls. Have hobos, they don't exist. You turn into prostitutes, I got you. It makes sense. Exactly. Okay. Um, well, <laughs> dude, they're so gross. I, I'd have to go with the non-gay one. I'm sorry. Just go with, go with my mom's, you know, little time of the month juice. I, did, I think I opted out for the same thing when I had a similar question like that. So How do the hobos love- get the video camera? Okay. Yeah. What do you think it's that question? Thing. I don't know. They stole it, probably. Okay, but they have white, so that's all that matters. All right, kaboom. 
Are you ready? I'm ready. All right. All right. Would you rather live your whole life needing to desperately pee and being unable to do so, or live your whole life peeing immediately wherever and whenever the urge comes? I would have to desperately need to pee but not be able to do so because at least you wouldn't be pissing yourself in public. Like, dude, whereas in the other one, that, so that, that feeling you get though, like that feeling you have to go pee so bad you can't. Come yeah, on. but imagine just like being in class, or, like being at a wedding, or like on a date, and all of a sudden you just piss. Well, yourself. that's why you. That's why you wear depends, dude. Yeah, yeah dude. get a catheter, bro. I never thought of that. Alternatives, man. Come on, there's a there's a way. We're Come gonna go with the first one now. Yeah, we made you change your mind. Peer pressure. Okay, no, good. no, the first one. Uh, I didn't change my mind. I'm going with the second oh, one. Still re- Oh, that's crazy. Yeah, you're whatever. stupid. Okay. Uh, you're an idiot. I'm just I'm saying. Dumb, dude. Stupid, stupid head. Yeah, <laughs> dummy. You showed me. All right. You go to college, uh, dumb. Shut up. Yeah, shut up. Would you rather watch your mom get her nipples pierced or watch your dad get his balls pierced? Hmm. I would rather... <laughs> Isn't this the one where Kenny had me... Instantly said his mom. Yeah, fucking freak. <laughs> <laughs> uh, well, just because I want to be opposite of Kenny, I'd rather watch my dad get his balls pierced. That way I can just call him an idiot over and over and over. Yeah. As opposed to uh, having the awkwardness of watching my mother get her nipples pierced. Yeah, yeah Kenny's... It's awkward to watch your dad have balls pierced. It wouldn't, dude. It's like, it's it's It'd guys. be more comedic to me than awkward. Okay. I just feel yeah. Like that. Okay. All right, Riz. What's up? Hello. Would you rather be molested by every member in Phase, or strangled to death by your own mother? So that means I die. Yeah, these questions are normally like a no-brainer because it's like, well, who wants to die? But who wants to get? And again, who wants to be phase kids, phase? Kids exactly. Phase. They're all well. I'm gonna guess that they don't have big penises. So. Unless they still want to be too bad. Yeah, I said the phase kids. I'm upset. Um, I might, might have to go on and go with the phase people. No homosexual. I mean, do they have a girl in there? Is there a girl in phase? I don't think so. I don't think uh, they exist, no. Well, uh, step go cool, with man. the gay one. Yeah. Staying on the rape train. All right. All right. Uh, kaboom. You ready yeah. for this one? I'm All right. ready. All right, Kaboom, would you rather being the hottest girl ever, but all she does is lie and say that you're how <laughs> and say how small your dick is, <laughs> or being an ugly girl that your sex is amazing? Gotta bang the hottest girl ever, because I mean it's only gonna last Even about thirty seconds anyway. Like, so you know. I'll shit to you the whole time. <laughs> what if she's, absolutely, what if she's absolutely. humiliating you? Like just tell thirty you. seconds. I'm willing to take that for thirty seconds. I mean that could wow. scar you for that, life. That would be your whole life, dude. The way you'd be like, oh, yeah, but move. imagine just banging the, the shit out of some ugly chick. Imagine it's like okay. going to sleep and then waking up with that like that picture just burned on the inside of your eyelids every time you wake up. But that confidence like, boost of her saying it was good, dude. Like I know you've never heard that before. Like, it's true to hear. Not true. Yeah, but I'm used to the first one, so I'm gonna have to go with a hot chick. All right. All right. All right. All right. Whatever. Man. Nuts. Would you rather? Yeah. Have your privates completely removed by a total stranger, or remove your own privates? Well, either way, that sucks. <laughs> yeah, that's either way, I'm losing my privates. So <laughs> what kind of question is that? You know, you lose your either privates. way, you it's a lose lose situation. I mean, most of these questions are lose lose situations. But either way, I'm ending up without a dick or balls. So I'd rather just probably do it myself then. <laughs> you think you could do it yourself? I couldn't do it myself. Yeah, I think I need somebody to help I mean, me out. You had to. Nah, uh, I don't. Uh, I don't know, man. I guess yeah. I guess in that situation, yeah, you're right. It'd be easier just to have somebody do it and just like yeah, because you would. Okay, Let's yeah, yeah. I, I changed my answer. Peer pressure made me change. My yeah, answer. it's peer pressure. It's peer pressure. Yes. All right. All right. <clears throat> is it? Who is it? Who's starting? Um, it's me asking you. Okay. Would you rather? Have a horse dick stuck up your ass, well, or have a sexy shemale come in your mouth. <laughs> <laughs> okay, are shemales considered guys or girls? Uh, it's basic. It doesn't. It's a chick with a dick. Yeah. Oh, it is. But so she's a chick, though. Well, I guess Relatively it could be. Speaking, I mean, do I mean, depends on how you look at it. 
Is it really a chick? Okay. Like, but the thing is, it wouldn't be gay. And I heard it's that. a girl that it's, okay. It's a person that looks like a female. Okay. That has tits and a dick. So I'm just going to say she's a female. And I heard that it sometimes it feels good taking it up the butt. So uh, and then you know getting it in my mouth might not be too bad. So I'd rather not take that horse. I'd probably die if the horse came at me like, like that. Extra. Extra hands? Yeah, I'd, I'd be dead. So I'd just go with the she man. Just destroy your rectum, yeah. Yeah, it'd be done. I won't even have a rectum anymore. So, I'd, right, so you're going to take the mouthful of spooge from the man, yeah, the female? Yeah, penis. I like it anyways, dude. My dad, you know. But uh, my turn. All right. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Kaboom, are you ready, man? I'm ready. All right. So uh, would you rather have a slutty mom or have a slutty daughter? Slutty mom. That one's Why? easy. Why? Elaborate. Well, I mean, if it's a slutty daughter, it's, it's something that you created. Whereas if it's your mom, it's kind of your fault if it's your daughter. But if it's your mom, it's not really your fault, and and you probably don't know who your dad is, but at the same time, it, at least <laughs> it's not something you've had some sort of control over at some point in time. Her vagina hanging like sleeve of wizard. <laughs> 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 oh man! I I don't even know where to go with that one. Um, <laughs> just, 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 just go home. Just later. stop, dude. <laughs> <laughs> somebody else. Somebody else. Ask me we gotta hurry up. We got time okay. for like one more each. All right. Okay, right. Nuts. Would you rather uh, lick thirteen girls with herpes or one person you love and never do it again? So I have. Wait, what was it? Would you rather lick 13 <laughs> girls with herpes? Okay. Or one person you love and never do it again? Lick? Yeah. Where am I licking them? Where do you think you're licking them? Yeah. On their hand? On their herpes infested vagina. Okay, so. Basically. Basically, <laughs> eat out a girl with herpes. Yeah, you're basically or, getting herpes in your mouth. Or. Mmm, yummy. Eat out one girl for the rest of my life. One no, time. one girl oh. that you love and never be able to do it ever again. Oh, that's, uh, I'm cool with not being able to eat out a girl ever again. So I'll just do the one I love and I get herpes. Oh, there we go. That's a. F- I mean, <laughs> that's pretty easy to me, right? Yeah, I mean, yeah, I I agree. All right, last one, Riz. Hey, would you rather have pancake size areolas <laughs> <laughs> or nipples the length of hot dogs? <laughs> I just made that up, by the way. Oh, so. That's fantastic. <laughs> okay, both of them. I wouldn't be able to wear a shirt correctly, so I don't. Know. You can wear a shirt correctly with pancakes. No. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> no one would sure you can. I mean, I mean, unless you're wearing like a white uh, beater and then they like poke out the top or just come out the sides, like ooze out. But hot dog, you know, I don't know. I'm gonna go with the pancakes, maybe, because they're nice and flat. I would agree. I'd go the same way. Yeah. All right. All right, well, we are out of time, so I appreciate you sick assholes coming on here and doing this for me. Oh, yeah, no problem. Yeah, thanks for having me, bro. All right, and uh, make sure you guys send in your questions to wouldyouratherties at gmail.com, and we will see you guys next time. All right. Later, people. Yeah, bye. Goodbye. Bye. Bye, guys. Bye. T.S. Riz is the best.